Hello everyone, thanks for tuning in this week. Uh, it's been a while, been very busy, and I hope everyone had a nice Father's Day weekend. Fourth of July's coming up. Busy doing a lot of stuff with family and friends and all that. But we got a lot of cool things planned, and also been playing a lot of the Shredder's Revenge. Hopefully we can talk about that later too, but thanks for tuning in, and for continuing to tune in, and we have more fun and adventures to go through. Let's get into this one here. My next number goes out to a girl called April. It isn't Tommy and the Rugrats and everybody. We like games here. Desktop pinball. Classic pinball action. I'm not going to lie. That art is really good because it kind of still gives that illusion of it being old school. Of the, like the first season of it where it's kind of a little, you know, not as clean. More scratchy kind of looking. That is very cool. And it's a little briefcase. You can carry them with you. I'm, hey, I'm, a, I'm going to work. The heck with the bringing in paperwork. Uh, I'm going to play pinball. <laughs> Uh, so let's have some fun with this, open up, and we'll play it. Rugrats Pinball. This is pretty neat. I like the other Nicktoons on here. Can we get some stuff with the Rocco? Oh, and Reptar's on the side. He looks so hungry. Look at him. He looks so cute. Ah, Reptar's so awesome. Holt, I am Reptar. Holt, I am Reptar. And there he is, uh, kicking and destroying stuff because Reptar's awesome. That's pretty neat. That's pretty awesome. Let's look into it already, shall we? Plus, there's a bonus thing at the end of this, too. Yeah. There it is, out of the box. So you can see there's a reptile's eyes watching the kids down. There's maybe lights or something. I am reptile. There's Phil. There's Lil. <laughs> right down there, you see the little pattern designs of the, their ball that there's fair. The binky the little pacifier. Not binky barns, you know, the the pacifier that they suckle on that's supposed to, you know, be like the mom's nipple and stuff. So they can get milk. Anyway, there's reptile chasing Tommy and Chucky. We even got Angelica and Susie down at the bottom. And right there we even have Grandpa Lou. Love Grandpa Lou. <laughs> and Spike. Look, they had Stu on there. Stu was awesome. <laughs> and then Reptar, of course, on there. There's that. There's little flippers on the sides. To move that, there's a little pulley thing. A uh, baby's gotta do what a baby's gotta do. The, indeed. Friends, indeed. Uh, uh, Made in China... I mean, where else? I don't know what else. And then there's a little backdrop thingy that says pinball. We got a nice shot of that, maybe. Can we? Yeah, we can probably do that, right? Yeah, that's pretty cool. All right, and that's supposed to go on here. If the folding looks like it should be folded this way, but it's supposed to be this way. But it's it is what it is, I guess. And yes, cheap, but again, five bucks. What do you expect? It's on there. And there it is, fully assembled on there. And the ball's in there somewhere. The This isn't uh, released, I guess. You gotta open this up to release the ball. I have no clue how that works. Maybe I gotta pull back. Uh, we'll figure out how this works, because there's uh, well, it tells us what to do here. You know, give me a second and we'll figure it out. So that part there, you have to go underneath and pull it for the ball to finally get out, and then you can finally launch, I hope, the ball into what it's got to do. Uh, let's give it a try. Cool. All right. Launch the ball, and it comes out of this flippy top right here, as you saw. Uh, very interesting. Let's get a play of it, I guess. Maybe we'll zoom out just a little bit more. Do we need any more to be seen? How about that? We don't need to see the... There's the flipper part. Uh, let's try. All right, it went into Lil's thing. I guess it's good. I like that it flips out of... Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. No, 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 no. There we go. Keep it like that. Oh, it's going to get stuck that way. Maybe it needs to stay up so it doesn't stay so flat, maybe. Oh. Oh. Susie, how could you? 
I got her saying Angelica. Oh! Causing mischief. But I was expecting you to help me, Susie. Okay, there we go. Okay, you're here to go back. It's so fast when it comes out of there, though. All right, all right, we got something. Maybe that needs to stay down. Because I feel like it's better, because it has to be tilted, right? Maybe we need that. Let's see. Nope, it just makes it worse. Maybe if I hold it like this, maybe we'll get a little better of a zoom in so you can see a little better. All right, let's try. That didn't work. All right, we'll try again. Oh no, now it's stuck in the thing. No, tilt, tilt, darn you. No, Susie. Okay, it doesn't work this way. It's worse that way. It's more of a challenge that way. Oh, oh, okay, so none of that. I still feel like it needs some kind of tilt. Oh, like to go up on the surface of flat on the ground. Oh my gosh. Oh, look at that. Look at that. That is craziness. Okay, okay. No! All right. Can we get it back in somewhere? No! It doesn't work that way. Yay! We got it inside that thing, right in here. See? So you can see the little ball right there. So, uh, yeah, it's stuck in there. It's stuck in there. I am Reptar. It is stuck in that side, that thing. Okay. But no, it doesn't. It looks like... What a shame, because it looks like this should light up. And it looks like there's something in there that makes it look like those things should do something. What a shame. Because I think that would be kind of neat. I just wanted something because I felt like it always got stuck when you tried to do this trick. See so if we can get one more thing and then we'll call it a quits and we'll move on to something else. Can we get a good, can we get one more good score on this? No, one more, one more until we get something. Come on, you guys, come on. There we go, we got an Lil. So there you go, that's pretty neat. Five bucks, classic pinball action. And by doing that, it rolled right into that. So we're good here. <laughs> Again, I like all the stuff there. I don't know if we got a better shot. Grandpa Lou and Spike. Reptar. All the little sayings it has on there. There they are. There they are. The art on it's really good. It's it anything, it's just a nice little uh a little display piece. And I guess kids can get into pinball early before they go and play some really awesome pinball games. So yeah, I it just launched it right into the hole. I couldn't be happier with that. And on to one little bonus piece we have here for Rugrats Fun. Oh, come on, Phil. Come on, Phil, 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 Phil. Thank you, Phil. All right, pretty fun. <laughs> on to the last scene of this, and then thanks for watching and all that. Flipping the flippers, shooting the ball, gonna score it all. Yeah, it's pinball, sorta. Pinball, sorta. Pinball sort of action, get it in the holes. I am Reptar. Well, of course we gotta do this, the Reptar wagon. It's pretty cool, it's a construction set. Holt, I am Reptar. Holt, I am Reptar. Thor, hungry, Thor, want eat. Uh, snap and switch, 35 pieces, it's got Tommy Pickles as well. Uh, go check our video where we actually had like an old school from like, what, 1998 Reptar wagon we found? Uh, from Well Played here, and this is perfect to include with the video you just saw. So hopefully you stuck around for this part, and we're going to construct this. And this will be perfect for a video we also got planning, because there's a lot of cool old Rugrat stuff that we've been finding for good deals and some unique things. Let's uh, get to this. And again, don't forget to smash that like button. It lets us know that, you know, that you're enjoying this. It helps out with everything and continues to keep doing more. Yeah. Yeah, Mushu says make sure you do it. Yeah! I was hoping it would fall out better than that. 
nothing else in there. We'll just uh, just toss that over here for now. All right. Here's the sheet of paper. I'm guessing that's going to tell us how to construct this and how to construct Tommy as well. All right. There's the wagon. There's the veals and everything. And there's Tommy. I feel like Tommy should be pretty simple to put together. Let's try all this. We did it. We got Tommy in there. There he is all around. Uh, it was pretty easy to assemble because it showed you in the instructions to attach the legs. The legs were already attached to the body, so we just need to put the arm, this blue piece, this piece, and the hands under there on both sides and then the head. So pretty neat. Now on to uh, a lot of pieces. Oh, I got it. Okay, so it secures nicely that way. And then this part here with the tail goes and that way look at that ha <laughs> that's cool all right so that needs to go like so all right he's looking good good so far and also the wheels the veals yeah wasn't as hard as I was making out to be but we got the veal in there and we'll just put the rest of them into the reptile way look at that one in there already yeah and he is complete the reptile wagon I'm not gonna lie that was actually it kept me occupied it kept me giving me something to do to pass the time from five below it was five bucks so yeah it's a neat little thing it's a neat little thing i liked it uh tommy i guess can go in there i know he's in the back right now but he can go in the front one i feel like putting him in the front i guess uh he has a spare hand and we'll just leave that in the back of the reptile wagon i guess for now but yeah look at that that is pretty cool we did it we made the reptile sorry tommy why kid <laughs> so again thank you for watching and make sure we want to get the angelica one there we almost did but it's like uh, but the reptile wagon is important we don't we, we need oh i forgot the hand was in there <laughs> we don't need the treehouse thing but maybe that's a good idea because then who's gonna be in the other uh seat with tommy can i get tommy to sit in here am i gonna have to take off his head to get him to sit in there can i even do that can i take off the reptile wagon head Let's see, does that work? And then can I close the head back on? Yeah! So it makes it look like Reptar is cosplaying. Uh, uh, Tommy is cosplaying as Reptar. But it works, he's in their vehicle and maybe we'll get Angelica. Let us know if we should get the Angelica one. And stay tuned for more uh, cool things we found some old regrets. So this is pretty neat. Halt, I am Reptar. Shame he doesn't actually say that. It says it on the box. Halt, I am Reptar. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Thanks for watching, everyone. Hope you liked this video of uh, this cool Rugrat stuff. And uh, who doesn't love the Reptar wagon? Reptar is cool. He's like Godzilla, only not. <laughs> but Godzilla's awesome. Ain't that right, Godzilla? Uh, yeah. Someday. Maybe someday you'll face the our way in later thanks for watching we love you all